Yo, what's going on guys? It's Chaos here and welcome back to the channel. Alright, this video has been a long time coming, alright? Clearly, we got Sonic Colors Ultimate here, but this isn't just any version of Colors Ultimate, alright? This is Project Re-Rainbow, a mod that aims to completely overhaul what was the disastrous release of Sonic Colors Ultimate and actually make it look and feel like a true remaster of a once beloved Sonic game, alright? So, shout out to Goku Black for sliding me the download for this because the regular downloads just straight up weren't working i i don't know why they wasn't but if you want the mod i'll leave the link for it in the description on game banana good luck to you i hope the download works for you but uh i'm finna sink my teeth into this but before we do if you're new to the channel consider subscribing and if you like the video drop a like but uh without any further ado Let's go ahead and get straight into it. Okay, so I'm not going to be playing through the entire game, all right, because there's just no point to me doing that. I'll do that once the, the whole full release comes out, but we can go ahead and check out Tropical Resort. You know, we can check out all the Act 1s, basically. Yeah, Trop Tropical Resort taking a minute to load up there. It's on my hard drive, but goddamn. I'm home, bruh. I'm home. Yeah, this this is in way way better way better than colors ultimate initial release this is way better i mean just looking it looks like gens like legitimately it looks like gens that's how good this looks man like tropical resort like no bloom i'm not blind oh man it looks so good it looks so good dude like even the earth in the back looks better yeah and i got i got supersonic on so won't be using any wisps today actually I do want to see what supersonic looks like so we should get 50 rings here oh wait hold up hold up hold up let me take a look okay so we still got the blue lightning effect that's kind of cool oh man it, it looks way better man it looks way better I don't know if I prefer how supersonic looks here to the original because the original like supersonic had like a nice glow and like reflection to him like here I mean don't get me wrong he looks nice here but like I don't know, it's like way too yellow, in my opinion. Like, that's a very vibrant yellow. Damn, them shits. Oh, and they put, wow, they put 3D model wisps in there. That's great. So they must have did it for the wisps capsules, too. Oh, dang, that's fire. But, the dude, the the gold capsule thing itself like the water on the inside like bro that shit has never looked so good all right so that was act one we'll do act three as well why not act three is personally one of my most favorite acts in this game can't go wrong with it don't know why i'm taking the top path i can't use the laser but man it like it just it looks and feels like the wii version once again like that's what's crazy about it and that's the thing, like, Sonic Colors Ultimate on PC has 144 hertz support, so, like, this is really smooth for me on my end. Give me this. I need more boost. Alright. Man, it just looks so good, dude. I can't get over how good this... Tails, shut the fuck up. Hold up. Give my Supersonic. Alright. Keep it going here. I keep forgetting, Supersonic doesn't have a double jump. He just has one big-ass jump. Hey, there we go. But yeah, Tropical Resort looks better than it ever has been before. Because Tropical Resort and Colors Ultimate was just... The bloom really washed out a lot of the colors of the game. I will admit. We're gonna go ahead and check out Sweet Mountain here. Oh my gosh, man. It's just such an improvement. It's just such an improvement. Like, damn, the fog on the bottom looks great, too. Bro, they cooked. They cooked with this mod. Like, bro, look at the light rays at the top. Bro, it, Sweet Mountain has never looked this good, ever. All right, go through here. Got my supersonic. Uh, just give me the supersonic. Let's just go fast. And supersonic is so slippery. But that's what I like about Color Supersonic. And there we go. I mean, bro, the water in the capsules looks so clean. Oh, my. All right. Sweet Mountain has just been looking pretty pretty damn great. Like, I can't get over these light rays, man. The lighting looks so good. 
All right, come through here. I'm on homing attack. All these guys. I want more boost. There we go. Come up through here. And like it even gets dark because we're technically under things right now. We're I wouldn't say we're indoors, but things are or level design is you know it's like blocking the lighting, so it actually gets darker in certain areas. And actually, there is one spot in this level we're finna check right now. Come over here. Switch to this rail. This room right up here. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. This is exactly how this is this is exactly how it's supposed to look. But this room specifically, the lighting was so messed up. Like the lighting from outside would just bleed into the room. It would basically look like this. It would basically look like that. You see how like it gets way more gray and less blue lighting, less dark in here? That's basically how it looked in Ultimate, like vanilla Ultimate. But now they actually got the lighting just right. They got it down. All right, we'll do a bit of Act Five just because I wanna I wanna marvel at Sweet Mountain some more. Oh, it just it looks so good, man. Rainbow rings got changed back to their original state. They don't have that spring sound along with it. Same thing for the dash pads. The thing is about Colors Ultimate, I actually liked how the rings looked in this game. I can't I can't lie. Like don't get me wrong, the old, the regular ones, the regular rainbow rings and orange hoops, they're pretty cool. They look pretty good. But the ones in Colors Ultimate, it was, nice, it was a nice little style change. I appreciated it. This is what I love about Supersonic. Blocky 2D is not a thing for Supersonic. Wrong way. Hold up. Dude, what? I couldn't... Okay. Hold up. Let me try this again. There we go. Alright. Next, of course, is Starlight Carnival. Dang, this overworld already looks better. But Starlight Carnival, holy shit, was bright as fuck. The bloom absolutely blew Starlight Carnival out of proportions. Alright. So this already looks infinitely better. Oh yeah, this this already looks inf hello. But yeah, this looks infinitely better. Nowhere near as bright. Nowhere near as obnoxious. I mean, actually, it does look a bit darker overall. But I'm not really hating. That's not a bad thing. All right, so what about inside the ship? Because this was... The bloom in here was absurd as well. And, yeah, it looks infinitely better, man. It looks infinitely better. This area could be lit up a bit more. Because it's really dark over here. But, that is fine. I just can't get over how good this looks, man. Like, it, it legit feels like a true remaster. Just gonna hit the supersonic. Yeah, this looks... I can't get over how this looks, man. Like, even the even the earth texture down there, it's like... It's, it's sharp. Like, I can make out details on that. Like, the space dust as well in the background, it looks so good. I'm waiting for the fat one. Is the fat one gonna push up? Nope. This sequence isn't lagging for me anymore. This this part of the level would lag for me on Colors Ultimate. So I don't know if the mod did anything to fix that, but it's not lagging. Okay, we timed this correctly. There we go. And we got Supersonic, so this is absolutely no, absolutely no trouble. It actually took me a minute to unlock Supersonic in Colors Ultimate, because if there's one thing about origin, original Colors that was low-key annoying, it was... Actually, let me look at this room. But if there's one thing about OG Colors that was annoying, it was the Red Ring Hunting. Red Ring Hunting was low-key difficult without a guide okay Sonic all right Super Sonic looks actually amazing right here this this frame specifically looks really good and I mean even this room looks way better this room was like really bright for no reason it was absurdly bright for no reason this room
like intro animations look great sonic is actually expressive oh and they changed thing i just noticed that they changed the park tokens to eggman coins that actually looks really good something i do actually want to see i don't know if i got that specific download but apparently they um they redid cutscenes entirely in game instead of having that ai upscaled bullshit so let's just see okay wait no no not that let's see if the cutscenes are oh my god oh my god oh my god this is so much better bro tails tails look so good oh my god so is this still okay This would still be AI upscaled, right? Cause this was this wasn't um This wasn't in-game cutscenes back on the Wii. This was CGI, I think. Yeah, you can tell this is still AI upscaled. So can't make no changes now to this. Anything pre-rendered is just stuck the way it is. It looks a little weird since it is in-game. I wanna see how far Okay, so they got they got baldy nose hair. Whoa, what is that lighting around Sonic? All right, so I'm, I'm guessing that's just the lighting of Sweet Mountain. How far does this go? Surely this this one mod doesn't have like every cutscene, right? Dang, even this is redone. Okay, so does it go all the way to Asteroid Coaster? It does. Oh my goodness. This one cutscene, even back then on the Wii, I remember, I couldn't, I could never really see what was going on. One, because of the resolution, but two, because of the lighting. The lighting here is way brighter, and I can actually clearly see what's happening here. Man, Sonic looks good. Like, you can see the fur on Sonic. It's not as detailed as Frontiers, but you can still see it, and I love it. Yep, I mean, even terminal velocity cutscenes, dude. Oh my goodness, that mustache. The detail. Man, they redid all the cutscenes, dude. Will I actually have a reason to play colors like normally now? I wonder how Planet Wisp looks. Because Planet Wisp in the original didn't look bad, in my opinion. In Vanilla Ultimate, it didn't look bad at all. Hold up, grass is way greener here, though. I mean, yeah, it still looks pretty good, in my opinion. I don't know if it's that much different from Ult Vanilla Ultimate, but it still looks great. I will admit, the glowing rock is it's really popping now. Like, right here, right here. The glowing rock right here is really, it's really fucking popping. Like, the flowers. Everything about this just looks great, man. Alright, I keep forgetting. I, I don't have any wisp powers available since I got supersonic equipped man this looks great like there's no clipping of the generator in the back the generator in the background during that section would clip in and out sometimes oh bro they even fixed the, the beginning part of act 6 in Planet Wisp so if you didn't know when you start off in Planet Wisp you would start off slow. In the original, you would start off at the re at the regular speed, you know, in like regular vanilla colors on the Wii. But in Ultimate, you would start off on this rail going slow, and then you would hit the booster and then start going fast. But as you can see, they start you off at the same speed, so you're not starting off slow anymore. Bro, I can't. They actually just they they just straight up fix colors Ultimate. That's insane. Planet Wisp. Low key seems to be the only place with minimal changes. Like it didn't really look that much different to me. Now, oh my goodness, this looks crazy. This looks crazy. I'm not gonna lie, this beginning part of Act One for Aquarium Park, this looks crazy. This looks insane. Oh yeah, it looks way better. Look at that water! Oh my, yo, look at that water. Oh my gosh, bro. Bro. 
Look at the freaking reflections, bro. What? They didn't fix that rail slowdown. I don't know what that rail slowdown is right there. That was one thing I was really hoping they would fix. But the water looks so good. Oh my goodness. Aquarium Park might be the best looking... The best looking zone with these changes. This... Aquarium Park has never looked so good. I just took no damage to that missile, by the way. Alright, come on. Let me through. There we go. Like, even right here, the lighting on these egg pawns just looks amazing as well. Man, they actually they did a great job with this. Alright, so we're here in Act 3 of Aquarium Park. Because I'm pretty sure there was one portion of this level... Okay, I, how the fuck did I even... I have no idea what happened right there. But, like I was saying, there was one portion of this level... Right? Specifically, parts of the game where there would be, like, a loop-de-loop -loop with dash panels in the level design. Most, if not all of those portions of level design was broken in Vanilla Ultimate. So, we're gonna keep going here to see if we can get to it and see if they actually fix those loops okay it wasn't act three it wasn't act three i got a mistake and it was act six but underwater looks way better way more clear i forgot to mention that by the way okay so we're reaching the area it was right here i'm gonna get this and then go down here this spring yeah that whole sequence that whole sequence where it was like a half pipe or a half loop that whole sequence would break in Vanilla Ultimate, bruh. They actually fixed it. So not only did they fix the visuals, they also fixed all the broken little bits of Colors Ultimate that wasn't broken in the original Colors. Bro, they actually cooked for this mod. They cooked. <laughs> Yeah, in case you didn't know, Supersonic Underwater is absolutely fucking OP. Like, oh my goodness. I forgot how broken Supersonic is underwater. Like, I could just straight up kill these things. Oh, yeah. Alright, there we go. Gold ring. But, dude. I mean, this, this mod is literally just perfect. This mod is just perfect. There is one more thing I want to check before we end the video here. In Asteroid Coaster Act 1, there is this notorious or notoriously known Wisp capsule that you can't grab because they didn't code in they didn't code in the freaking collision for it in vanilla ultimate. So I wanna see if this mod fixes that problem. Cause this is probably my biggest pet peeve about this game is that I can't get my boost off the start of the level all right it doesn't look like they fixed it yeah i'm jumping i still can't collect that capsule oh man that sucks that was the one thing i was hoping they actually truly fixed i mean not to say that anything else they done was like not worth it like obviously it's worth it but i was really hoping they fixed that because that one with capsule that you can't get that really annoys me Wait, 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 wait. There we go. I missed my ride? Tail save putting me in a... In 3D, in a 2D section. So that's still... Yep, that's still a problem. Alright, now I got my supersonic. Okay, chill, motherfucker. Chill. I know you're slippery. Just boost all the way over here. Yep, that works. Thank you. Holy... Wait, wait. Where am I? I'm dead. Okay. I I missed it? Alright, we spin the block. There we go. Alright, there's no doubt that's like a C at best. Yeah. Alright. Asteroid Coaster is as I expect it to be, honestly. We can go ahead and check, uh, 
terminal velocity. From first looks, it looks way more blue, at least in the level select. But this, yeah, this already looks 10 times better. Well, that sucks. I didn't notice that. Those guys, those first set of dudes, are supposed to fly up and get destroyed by the little, the little arch. But they don't fly up into it in this version, I guess. I just looked at the earth, by the way. Holy shit, how detailed. Bro, I'm, I'm looking at the continents, and I can just see the land formation. Oh my goodness. Hold up, can I get a view of the earth again? That was amazing. That, like, bro, that looked as good as, like, the earth and frontiers from space. And we just use supersonic, and we just go forward here. Dude, I want to look at the earth again. Oh my goodness, that looks so good. Hmm. Quick stepping slows you down. I actually didn't know that. Because dude just caught up to me while I was boosting. Yeah, look at this. Oh, I didn't know that. Quick step is slow. It's slow in this game. Or it slows you down. Bro, look at the earth. Like, what is that? Is that a crater? What is this? I've never noticed this. Bro, that looks like a, a straight up crater on the surface. Apparently, I didn't get all S ranks of terminal velocity, so went ahead and got that done. Probably make this look way better. Yeah, this looks like the Wii version now. The boss looks way better. If you didn't know, uh, Vanilla Frontier, Frontiers, Vanilla Ultimate, like the boss shading it had, it was like weird. Because a perfect example is like, look at the eyeballs of this robot, right? Like you, you can't really see them. Like you just see like the little, you just see like the little visor that's cover covering the eyeballs, because the eyes are actually blue in here. If you didn't know, they are blue, and Ultimate made these little visor things like see through, so you could actually see the eyes. But from a distance, you can't really tell. It just looks like one face with no eyes. But Eggman looks really good here. Sonic too. Like, just the animations with these upgraded, like, just graphics, it's, it's amazing. It really is. Okay, hold up. This thing over here is really dark. It should be a bit more lit up than that. Okay, I don't know what's going on with the laser there. Why is it going, like, backwards and forwards? Color's Ultimate is still rough around the edges. Even with the help of this mod. Okay. You can't hop over the laser anymore? I didn't know that. Wow, that is lame. You should you should be able to hop over that. Especially when it gets too quick. Because that's the whole point of having the hop. He fires a laser too fast for a regular jump to work so you're just supposed to hop when he speeds up but that de it defeats the purpose if the hop if I can still get hit and there we go yeah boss didn't really seem to be changed that much I mean other than just making it look like the original so yeah I mean that's Sonic Colors Ultimate Project Re Rainbow uh, amazing mod probably the best mod to come out this year for any Sonic anything. So, uh, yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed. Actually, hold up. I just, just random thought, random thought. Maybe they touched this up? I mean, there's not much you can do to game land. Yeah, this looks unchanged a little. I'm not sure if it's like the green is more green. I can't tell if the lighting is really any different. Like, I, I barely touched Game Land on this. Like, I just... I just... I mean, I played it to get Super Sonic. I did do that, but... Like, come on. I wasn't paying attention to it. So, I can't really tell. But uh, yeah, like I said before, guys, hopefully you guys enjoyed. Let me know what you guys think about this mod in the comments below. The link for it will be in the description. 
And like I said before, if you like the video, drop a like. And if you're new, consider subbing to the channel. But uh, until next time, peace.